What's up guys? I just wanted to show you this quick case of a pyloric stenosis patient. And usually pyloric stenosis patients are presenting with projectile vomiting and a loss of weight. So they're not gaining weight, especially, you know, one month old, two month old babies, and they're vomiting a lot, like after every feed. So the first thing you do when you put a probe down and you can tell it's positive, is you can see the pylorus muscle here. It's pretty thick. And this is the canal or channel where the fluid is supposed to go through. And you can tell that, whoa, well, it's positive, like right when you put the probe down on baby. So this is a gallbladder right here. This is the left lobe of the liver, stomach, and then this is the pylorus area. So I was like, whoa, it's positive because you know, you can see that it's very elongated. So very long. And this is the anterior wall, anterior wall right here. And then this is a posterior wall right here. This is the channel and it's supposed to go through. It's supposed to open and the fluid is supposed to go through here. So we're supposed to feed them Pedialyte and watch it in live time. So you can see here that the length is really long, 1.9 centimeters. The wall thickness is, 5.5 centimeters on both sides so yeah you can see here that it's very very thickened I did it again and it's still very long and so this is like your classic case of pyloric stenosis so after I take a look without the Pedialyte I feed baby Pedialyte even if it is positive we want to see improve and make sure that the fluid is not going through the canal. And every time we get a pyloric stenosis patient, we feed them pylorus. We feed them, not pylorus, we feed them Pedialyte, yes. And then the Pedialyte, we try to watch it to see if it goes through. So here's the stomach, it's getting bigger and dilated because the Pedialyte's getting in there, but it's not going through the channel or the canal to the, rest of the body so you can see it right here clear as day this is the fluid not going through and then i take a cine and you can see it's not going through at all you can see that the fluid's just chilling just chilling in there and we're trying to see if it goes through that channel and it's not I take another cine, nothing's happening. And then I take more pictures just to prove nothing's going through. Yeah, so that's a quick video of pyloric stenosis. Interesting, right? If you have any questions, comment down below, and I hope you guys enjoyed this little video. Bye.